Okay, I'm going to show you how I leveled up my enchanting. Uh, this is my sort of starting hole, hidey hole. Uh, I'll take you outside first and just uh, I'll show you my. Basically, I chop trees to get wood, like most people do. Um, and as I chop, I collect the um, the little saplings. And yeah, just basically grab all the wood and come back. The saplings will drop later. So yeah, chop, 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 chop. I think you get the idea. So I probably spend like one day, uh, which is not long at all, a couple of minutes, because the sun the sun comes down pretty quick. And I basically chop, 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 and just as it starts getting dark, I collect all the little saplings and plant them so that I've always got wood. Um, I'll take you inside. Oop. The freaking heck. Yeah, so um, I've got my enchanting over here. And basically you need to create all these bookshelves. Well, um, which require wood. Basically you get your wood, oh, get up there. So you just get your wood and then you create all your wood planks. And you also need to convert your sugar cane into pages or into paper. Over here I've got my room full of sugar cane which I basically farm. Um, each part has got some water with sort of a cross and you just plant sugar cane around each water and then I put a torch so I do it like a figure of three by three and just I do three by three three by three all the way around the room and yeah and just to farm it you just click around this level not too high not too low around the, the middle of the three bits of sugar cane and you just farm the whole room and um, it'll grow again and then from there we just go to our crafting table and you get your sugar cane you put three in there and you create your paper now with your paper you want to make a book and you need some leather so down here I've created my farm where I've got wheat um, it's basically one two three four rows and then I have a row of water one two three four one two three four and another row of water later on I'd probably dig out that wall put another row in if I need it above the water I've got some um, like a row of blocks there that have got some um, torches on I think torches every second blocks maybe an overkill sometimes I put them every block as well but um, yeah as long as there's enough light um, they'll grow so normally I'll go along here and I'll just like farm out all of this uh, and just seed as I go all the way down collect heaps of wheat and then I'll go down here and no I've got my chickens we don't want to feed the chickens we want to feed the cows so we'll go down here the next one and you can see how I've created these steps the cows can actually climb up these steps so it's sort of like a one-way trap where the first two cows I'd bring up here drop them over the edge and they can't get out and then I just like feed them all and then just grab an axe grab whatever you want just chop them all up Ugh hate doing this. I like animals, they're cool. Doing this is kind of uncool, but needs to be done. And from there you've freaking got some raw beef which you cook and you've got some leather which is exactly what you want. So up here we've got some leather. By then some of those cows would have bred. Oh and you get some XP as well. Like if you, as the cows breed, 
you get XP probably heard that little pop um, yep cool 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 so now we've got a leather, a leather and we go back and up the top we make some books yep, a bit more mm. need to eat Just eat something so from here we uh, what do we get oh yeah some leather and some paper make some books from there let's make some planks of wood you need two level levels and then you get your books we've got six yep. hey and then we've got our bookshelves they stack and bookshelf goes there and we've got our bookshelves so yeah there we have it you just stack your bookshelves I have this configuration here where you have your enchanting table up above one block and then don't use the inside ring use the next ring outside and you can just do two layers like that and um, that's how you build up your enchanting I think you do another layer up there, I'm not too sure but um, yeah, you've got the idea cool